Well, hello again, everyone. Professor Prophet coming to you from Crabs University, and we've got one of our Roulette for Beginners series uh, videos for you today. Uh, this one is called Profitable Outside Bits. Now, this is only a $300 buy-in, so uh, not much risk here. And we will be we will be betting one dollar units, so uh, this is one you have to play at an online site. And of course, you want to practice this on your uh, uh, software at home before you take it uh, to a casino. Now, the brick and mortar ones you're going to have to bet more, probably ten dollar minimums on these. Uh, but today we're just learning, and these are one dollar bets. So uh, very simple bet, the three hundred dollar buy-in. So the win goal is thirty. And uh, we always encourage you to have a win goal so when you get there, you don't stick around and give that profit back to the casino. So let's head on down to the uh, virtual felt now and we'll explain exactly how this uh, strategy is bet, what the progression is, and then we'll spin the wheel for a few minutes and see if we have a casino worthy strategy. So let's head on down there now. We'll see you shortly. Okay, everyone down here on the virtual roulette table getting ready to spin uh, our roulette for beginners. And this particular uh, session, we're going to be doing a profitable outside bet strategy. Now, this does require a, uh, just a minimal $300 buy-in, so a low buy-in. And the way this is bet, we start off with a $3 bet on either the 1 to 18 or the 19 to 36. Uh, let's go 1 to 18 for 3, and then we pick one of the three columns. Uh, let's go at the first column for 2, and that's uh, so 3 on the 1 to 18, 2 on the first column, and that is all you have to worry about. Spin the wheel, and we'll get our first number established. Now, if we lose, then we increase by one unit, and that's another $3 on the 1 to 18, another $2 on the first column, and we'll continue to, to go up by 3 and 2 on each loss. And once we get back to our session high, we'll go back to the base level and begin again with this $5 bet. So $300 buy-in, so our win goal, 10%, is $30, and that will be our goal today. So let's go ahead and get the uh, wheel spinning, and let's hope we can get off to a good start here with this profitable outside betting strategy. So there's three red, so we do hit the 1 to 18, that's a $1 win. So we're going, to, we're going to go ahead and move the uh, chips around a little bit. And we'll go with 19 to 36 now for three. And second column for two. And we're up a dollar after the first spin. So if we make a dollar on all of them, we'll be in good shape. So there's 22 black. So that's another dollar win. The 19 to 36 is who win the high. So let's go ahead and take these down. And $2 on third column. And three dollars on the one to eighteen now, and our session high now is three o two, and we're spinning again. Here we go. So there's nineteen red, so that's a loss. So now we go up to our next level, and that's another three on the one to eighteen, and another two on the third column. So that's a ten dollar total bet. You can see that at the top of the screen. And our number is 8 black, so we do hit the 1 to 18, and that gets us up to 299, so that's still not our session high. So uh, let's clear these out, and we'll go to the 1936 for 6 now. And 4 on the first column, that's $10 bet again. And we're spinning, here we go. And there's 33 black, so that's a uh, another hit for us. We hit the high, the 19 to 36. That puts us at 301, so we're still not quite where we need to be. So let's clear this out again, and we'll go back to the 1 to 18. Or 6. And second column, 4, 4. Number this time is eight black, so that's the jackpot number, and that's when you hit both the column and the high low. So that puts us all the way up to 315. That's a new session high. And just like that, we're halfway to our session win goal. So let's clear this out, and now we'll start back over. 
So that's $3 on the uh, 19 to 36 and $2 on the third column. That's a $5 total bet. And we're spinning and we're rolling and we have a 14 red. So that's a loss. So let's go up another three on the high and two on the third column. High being the 19 to 36 when I say that. Uh, low is the one to 18. So there's the green monster. So that's another loss. So another uh, three and two. That puts us at a $15 total bet, which you can see at the top of the screen. And there's eight black, so we're getting on a bit of a losing streak here. So now we're up to $20 total bet as we add another three on the high and two on the third column. And there's seven red, yet another loss. So uh, we've got um, 24 numbers covered, so it's unusual to start losing this many in a row. So we finally uh, do hit the high. It's $25 level, so that's a $5 win. So uh, we'll take these down. And we'll stay at the same level. We're just moving the bets. So it's 15 on the uh, 1 to 18, the low, and 10 on the first column. And we're spinning. Here we go. And that's 14 red, so we do hit the low. We missed the column, but that's another $5 win. So now we'll move back to 19 to 36 and go to the second column. So we still have a $15 and a $10 bet, so 25 total. And we hit 29 black, so that's a jackpot number. We hit uh, both the column and the high-low, this one being the high. And that puts us at uh, 310. Still not our session high, however. So at this point, you can uh, uh, stay at the level you are, or you can go back down to your base level since you're within $5. Uh, I think we're going to go ahead and stay where we are this time and just see how this works out. So three on the low, one to 18. Or, or 15 on the low, and 10 on the third column. If we can get another uh, jackpot number here. So there's 21 red. We don't get a jackpot. We did get third column, however. So that does put us at our session high, 315. So now we will go back down to our base level. And that's uh, three on the high and two on the first column. And we're spinning again. Here we go. 29 black, so we do hit the high. That puts us at 316. So let's take this down and we'll move to the low and the second column, another $5 wager. And see if we can keep rolling here. That is seven red, so we hit the uh, low, so that's another dollar win for us. So that puts us at 317. And again, our uh, goal is a $30 win, so that puts us at $330. So we're better than halfway there now. And there's 27 red, so that's another high hit for us, another $1 win. So we'll take this down, go back to the low, and go to the third column for two, $5 total bet. And we are spinning. Here we go. So that's 13 black, so that's another $1 win. So let's move back again to the high. First column, and we're spinning. So 319 now is the uh, session high. And 30 red on this one, so that's another uh, win on the high-low. That puts us at 320. So let's move our bets again. So three on the low, two on the second column, $5 total. And I don't know if, you've, if I mentioned this or not, but if you want to uh, get used to playing roulette and you want to increase your wagers, uh, if you want to play this at the $5 level, the $10 level, um, whatever level you're comfortable with, um, as long as you keep the 3 to 2 ratio uh, on 
on the uh, bets. It should work out fine uh, at any level. So $3 again on the high and 2 on the third uh, column. And our session high right now is 321. And that's 9 red, so we do hit the column. That's another $1 win that puts us at 322. So let's go back to the low for 3, the first column for 2, 3 to 2 ratio. If we're at a $10 level, it would be $30 and $20. And, of course, you'd need a, a bigger bankroll also. So we hit the low on this one. We get, uh, we're get we on a bit of a winning streak here, up to 323. And so let's move to the high and the second column now. And we're spinning. Here we go. That's 16 red, so we do miss on both there. So we'll increase to 6 and 4 now. Still have that 3 to 2 ratio on our bets, however. And let's see if we can get back on track here. There's the green monster there, the 0. So we're up to 9 and 6. That's a $15 total bet. And a jackpot number here would be nice. That's 24 black, so we do hit the high. We don't get the column. That's a $3 win. That puts us at um, 311. So still not quite at our session high yet. So let's uh, clear these out. And we're at $9 on the 1 to 18. And $6 on the second column, I believe. That's what we're going to go with anyway, and we're spinning. Here we go. And there's that uh, zero again, so um, seen about enough of him. So we're up to a $20 bet now. That's 12 and 8. That's 22 black, so that's another loss. So up to 15 and 10 now, a $25 bet. And there's 24 black, so another loss. So a $30 bet now, 18 and 12. And uh, about time to get out of uh, reverse the curse here and uh, get a winner. So there's another loss. So we're at uh, 21 and 14, a $35 total bet now. And that's 20 black, so we do hit the column finally. So that's a $7 win. So um, we'll clear these out. And move the bets. Let's clear these out. There we go. And we're at 21 and 14. We'll move to the third column and the high, and we're spinning. Here we go. Still have a lot of work to do to get back to our session high and try to hit that win goal. There's another loss. There's 14 red. Up to a $40 wager now. And are already down uh, a little over $100 before this spin. So there's 20 black, so we do hit the high. So that's a little bit of a win. That puts us at 201 now. So we'll move our bets again. We're at 24 and 16 still. So let's go back to the low. And first column, $40 bet, and we're spinning. Here we go. 32 red, that's another loss, so we'll go up another level. And we're sitting at 45 now. And we're getting pretty deep into our bankroll, so we need to 
start hitting some numbers here. There's 31 black, so we do hit the column. So let's uh, clear this out, and we'll go back to 19 to 36 to 30. Second column for 15, $45 total. And that's 28 black, so that's another uh, high hit for us. So let's move it back to the low. And we'll go third column this time. And that's 27 red. And obviously I messed up the bet there somehow. So it should have been uh, at 30 and 20. At 30 and 15, it should have been 30 and 20. I just didn't didn't uh, put enough down there. So let's uh, clear this out and let's make it 30 and 20 this time. And we're spinning. Here we go. And there's 33 black, so that's another score hit for us. And uh, spinning again should have moved her bets, but we'll see if, see if that costs us or not. Uh, 22 black had actually helped us as a jackpot number, so we'll move it this time. And that gets us all the way up to 265. So let's clear these out. And 30. And 20. And spin. And there's that zero again, so it will add three and two. Double zero this time. I think the last two had been uh, single zeros. All losers, however. And there's 11 black, so we do hit both, and that puts us at 292. So let's clear these out. And we're at 33. And 22. $55 total bet, and we are spinning. 24 black, that's another jackpot number for us. And just like that, we hit a new session high, and we reach our goal, double our goal, plus some, and end up with a $69 profit. Uh, $369, we started with $300. And we're walking away with $369 in our profit, in our pocket. And that is a $69 profit. So that is the, one of our roulette for beginner strategies. This one's the profitable outside bet strategy. Uh, had a bit of a rough ride on this one. Um, usually it's not this difficult, but this particular strategy did have uh, enough strength to come back. And we got on a little bit of a roll there, hit a couple jackpot numbers, and found ourselves with a nice profit. Now, again, this does scale up if you want to play at a $5 level or a $10 level. You just have to remember to keep the, uh, the ratio at 3 to 2. And uh, you saw, saw what happened when you don't do that. I messed up. And instead of winning on one of our spins, we just broke even. So uh, that is the profitable outside bets strategy. Well, that was a pretty wild ride there. Although we had pretty good coverage on the board, uh, we had a couple uh, fairly long losing streaks there and got down, uh, I believe at one point we're down uh, almost half of our buy-in. Uh, but once we got rolling, we hit a couple of those jackpot numbers we talked about. And just like that, we had walked away with a $69 profit on a $300 investment. And that is a good day. So... Uh, uh, that is how the uh, profitable outside bet strategy works. Uh, if you are beginning at uh, roulette, it's a good one to have in your toolbox. And one you might want to try, uh, like I said uh, in the introduction, 
at the on the online casinos um, or if you want to take it to a brick and mortar casino you'll probably be required to bet ten dollar units instead of one dollar units uh, but uh, it does scale up and down fine you'll need your buy-in will need to be uh, uh, a lot more than three hundred dollars of course if you go ten dollar units uh, i would say at least two thousand dollars and maybe twenty five hundred uh, but uh, my advice to you is let's try it at the one dollar level on an online uh, casino or just practice it at home first before you start investing a lot of money so that is the profitable outside bet strategy one of the roulette for beginners I started with three hundred dollars walked away with three hundred and sixty nine dollars sixty nine dollar profit good day so we do thank you for joining us we hope you enjoyed that video if you did uh, we ask that you give us the old thumbs up and if you have not already subscribed to the craps university channel uh, we'd love to have you go ahead and sign on the dotted line there press that button and become part of the student body here at craps U. now we do offer full ride scholarships so it'll cost you absolutely nothing and uh, we uh, do roulette strategies on wednesdays and fridays and then we talk about crap strategies on sundays so that's three videos a week we're dropping and um, we uh, are talking about the two best games in the casino so once again thank you for joining us we hope you enjoyed the video and we'll come back and see us again until then this is professor profit coming to you from craps university and if you're out there spinning that wheel this week we wish you nothing but the best of luck and may all your numbers come up winners talk to you again soon Bye-bye.